But first, just some incredible video I gotta share with you once again. Have you ever seen anything like this before? We gotta send a shout out to our fantastic photographers for getting us this drone video tonight. Look at that bubbling water. It is a water main break in North Toledo. Homes and streets flooded, thousands under a boil advisory. And now everybody wondering how this even happened to begin with. We're going to check in tonight with Kaylee Marantad joining us. She has been on this story all day long. So Kaylee, the water has been shut off, but is it starting to recede? Yeah, Jeff, a lot of the water in surrounding streets is thankfully gone, but people's homes and cars are flooded, leaving people to wonder what just happened and what is there to do next? I opened the front door. I opened it up to all of this. Through the 12 years living on North Erie, Amy Wallace hadn't seen anything like it. Yeah, it's bad. The water is up to the ceiling in my basement, and we've lost everything down there. Furnace, hot water tank, washer dryer, personal items, computer. Others down on Galena Street also hadn't seen anything like this. This is a first. A water main break flooding dozens of nearby streets, businesses, and homes. It was all water all the way down. Yeah, mm -hmm. and then yeah there was, it, I've down. never seen water flowing like that. There's still no answer on what even caused the possible 48-inch or 60-inch water distribution line to burst. We have breaks all the time, um, but these large diameter that cause this kind of flooding, it's, it's rare. At the center was this SUV where a woman and her kids had to be rescued. It basically creates its own hole, but you can't see it, obviously, because it's the, the, the water's so deep. So she drove through it, assuming it was, you know, a shallow event. Little did she know there was an eight-foot hole she was driving through. The water is shut off and being cleared up. Flooded cars are being towed away. But for some homeowners like Wallace, the cleanup is just starting. We're at a total loss. Now I'm worried about foundation issues, mold, you name it. There is a boil advisory in effect for at least the next 24 hours. It could be up to 48 hours for this area. If you want to see if you're included, we have a link to that map on our website at WTOL.com. We will be sure to bring you any updates when it comes to repairs or anything else in this area when we learn more details. Reporting live in North Toledo, Kaylee Marantet, WTOL 11. Just going to piggyback what she said right there on air, online. Be sure to check out, download our WTOL 11 app so that we can send you those alerts should any of those boil advisories be changed. But right now, could be 24 to 48 hours.